Hey guys, decided to go live um, and we will look at the soap together. Um, I'll just wait a little bit for a couple of you to hop on. I wanted to mention too, um, if you guys are in a pinch and don't want to order online and you've got a Michaels close to you, you can get soap base and I think they sell fragrance too. So you can get a little bit of that to try it out and decide if you like it. Um, so this was the first soap we did and let me see if I can remember what we used. Okay. Black Knight, Nirvana, Wally Kazoo, Bippity Bop, and Huggy McHuggerton. So this was the first one. We put the pretty auroras down and then we covered it with the black base. So, fingers crossed, I have not looked at this, that it worked. And you can see some of that Nirvana. And I'm not, um, I'm not seeing comments. So, if you are making a comment, I will look at it later. That is awesome. Smells great. Looks great. It kind of has a, um, like a triple layered effect. Hey, Tasha. Hi, Cindy. Hi, Sh Shelly. Let me give this a spritz with alcohol. Sometimes that helps sh shine it up. So you can see it better. See, and you are seeing the color shift from those beautiful auroras and uh, the opal flake. So we can do chameleon in soap too. Pretty cool, huh? I know my spray job is a little bit of a mess. So this video is going to be really quick, but I just wanted to show you guys. Move this puppy over. <laughs> I know, Tasha, I saw you went live and I was out eating with the family. And I wanted to watch, but I couldn't be rude when we were out and about. Okay, this is the one I kind of had a beach idea on. Um, I'm super nervous about this one to see if it actually turned out, but you guys will find out with me. And when you guys, if you decide to do um, soap, use silicone molds. Do not use plastic. A lot of people sell, still sell plastic and they are pain in the butt. You'll never um, get your soap, well, you'll get your soap out, but you'll never reuse the mold again because you'll cut it in a million pieces. Whoop, that one's peeling. So, but this will be an easy fix. This one peeled up, but what I'll do, I'll hit it with a little bit of heat and just stick it back down. And I can see, I tried to create um, those waves. They did not work. But look at this one. This one does not look like a beach scene anymore. It looks more like Starry Night, but I'll take it. No, Annika, we went, I don't know, for burgers somewhere. So let me get you guys down. So totally not beachy. I will never get the beach thing. I was close once. But that, I was scraping it up, trying to create waves. It didn't work. But again, I'll hit it with heat and just fill those little lines in. And I will... Get 
give that a little spritz of rue to bring those colors to life. <laughs> Thanks, Amanda. So there you guys go. Super, um, you know, it's super easy to do melt and pour to get into it. In fact, I could probably just rub those together and they'll be okay. They'll fill in those cracks. And no one will ever know. But yeah, so Prince Charming, and that was with a little bit of leftover uh, Black Knight. And that just made the world of difference. And I'm gonna spray this. Actually, I'm gonna take you guys back off one more time to show you that layered effect of doing that eco glitter first. It's kind of hard to pick up, but it looks like two different layers, which it is, but just neat. Hi, Jamie. So you guys, they came out really good. I am stoked. And let's see, and I had, um, when I ended the live, I still had a bit, little bit left over and I told you how I love these molds. They are, are great for um, gifts for people. Um, the big molds I get at Wholesale Supplies Plus, and then these ones I think I got off, um, I think I got them off Amazon. And then don't forget, Bear Mountain Designs has molds too, you guys. Um, and it's perfect for just starting out. You can use little soaps. You can make little soaps with hers. Um, I have I have a couple, but they are not within reach distance. So check out Bear Mountain Designs for like molds to first try with soaps. But these are stinking adorable um, for gifts or yourself. And this one, um, I mixed a little bit more black, and I think this is, you need to calm down. Oh, no, it wasn't black. It was blew my mind, and you need to calm down. And they go perfect on the little soap dish. Boop! You knew you had to get one of my sound effects in one of these lives. So, and I'll put the soap, um, the soap dishes on the website if any of you soap makers are interested. They just come apart, easy clean, but they drain so that way your soap's not sitting in water. This is what I do late at night. This is what Woody's Goodies does. Um, I play on a 3D printer I just got and I stay up way too late because I am full on addicted to this thing. And I am not computer savvy, but boy do I have fun printing the most useless Fun things. Well, this isn't useless. I print a lot of other useless things. But that's it, you guys. Yes, Tasha is the absolute best at painting molds. Um, if you guys aren't in her group, Bear Mountain Designs, you should definitely join um, and check out her live because she is the queen of painting molds. And she does hers for soap and epoxy because she makes lots of magnets she does craft fairs and then she sells tons of soap too so she's a soapy too <laughs> oh my goodness Annika with uh painting the molds or Brenda, this is just melt and pour soap. I did a live earlier today, so um, just look, um, search my name, and you will see part one. This is basically part two. And this is just way easy peasy. I'm gonna give, I'm gonna spray my soap with a little bit of alcohol, so this'll help it not sweat soap sweats all right you guys um any questions that you didn't get to ask before I'll give it like a minute and if i don't see anything then have an amazing night
Yes, Amanda, I'm really happy with them. One more look, you guys. So, and that's not the camera playing tricks on you. It really does color shift like that. Except for it doesn't show how pretty the colors are, but we're getting green, brown, um, blues, oranges, and then we're getting pinks and blues and a little bit more orange. And then those guys, not beachy, but that's okay. Alrighty, you guys, I don't see any questions, so have an excellent night. Bye.